हेलो गाइस यू आर आर वेलकम टू लेक्चर नंबर 1030 एंड दैट इज अंडर द सीरीज ऑफ लेक्चर्स फॉर द मैन्युफैक्चर ऑफ परफ्यूम एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द रियल वर्क to manufacture the perfume here i am uh, discussing not any academic course is real industrial manufacture and industrial creation of fragrance different type of variants in fragrance industry and here i have written some very very important solvents and some uh chemical compounds synthetic as well as natural which are widely used globally and your all uh perfume manufacturing industries they are all around these chemicals and solvents which are mentioned here so let me show you here about the solvents so this uh, solvents uh first word is that is widely used uh, as a solvent and i have already told you the meaning of solvent and solute uh, perfumes are actually the solution uh, that is the combination of solvent and solute solvent means it may be ethyl alcohol it may be dgp it may be depo it may be bb and they are all mentioned on google in the short form and those who are interested to go in detail about all these constituents they can do but here mainly i am concerned with how they are used to manufacture the different type of fragrance so the first solvent is that is dgp is called diphenyl glycol and second one that is called dep that is a diethyl propanol is a type of also alcohol because ol is there propanol then bb that is benzyl benzoate this benzyl benzoate is also used here as a solvent and it is also widely used as a preservative in food industries and the very well known solvent uh, after water the universal solvent that is ethanol is called ethyl alcohol so these are all four type of uh, solvents which are used globally to manufacture the different type of perfumes the second is that is some perfume compounds this segment is very important for those people who are interested in going for perfumery business they want to become perfumer to create or to manufacture perfume so globally starting from nigeria india america europe everywhere once they are involved in manufacturing of perfume only they are moving around these chemicals either they are isolated from flower plant sources seed stem bark leaves or they are synthesized so the first very popular very powerful name globally is called iso e super iso e super chemically speaking it is just uh, tetramethyl uh, that is uh, anthras that is three nucleus uh, anthracene tetramethyl anthracene nucleus and this iso e super why it is super because it is on top of every uh perfume chemicals it is having musky and very very sweet smell and if we are going to manufacture any perfume first we are going to purchase super e iso e super and this iso e super i have already told you that once we are starting to manufacture perfume first is solvent solvent is 70% 70% 75% uh 
but mostly it is 70 percent so in the perfume especially in uh, french spray synthetic one uh, is 70 percent your solvent then 20 percent is your iso is super that is uh, perfume compound i call them perfume chemical compound which are ingredient of perfume are responsible of giving very very good fragrance so in that case you can put 20 percent 22 percent like that and then the remaining 10 percent 8 percent here you are doing all your creativity i need to drop this three drop this one drop uh, sandalwood oil two drop rose oil three drop uh, cardamom oil uh, black pepper uh, essential oil so all different type of essential oils are added and they are processed and then the perfume is created so first one which is most most important is iso e that is called iso e super so that is your iso e super and the second one that is called uh, lyra and this iso e super is having much woody smell even those who are interested to synthesize very costly perfume that is called musk they can use in good percentage iso e super and it will uh, give that then the second one is lyra lyra is also another very good uh, perfume chemical the third one is hedion fourth one is helional that is only high then poly central poly central this chemical compound is used to create sandal oil uh, fragrance and the sixth is methyl ion is an ion group of uh, floral uh, perfume then geraniol geraniol is the isomeric form of citral and geranium is converted into geraniol is a plant product and it has very good smell of orange or lemon or we can say it is uh, having uh, citrus uh, fragrance and number eight is methyl dihydro jasmine this methyl dihydro jasmine is the synthetic uh, compound chemical compound which is widely used to create jasmine very very costly perfume uh, fragrance so all these chemicals these chemical compounds of the perfume they are all available mostly in reputed uh, chemical shops and if we are talking of uh, in India the, there are hundreds of the uh, chemical industries which are producing all these perfumery chemicals but we cannot trust them so to my understanding the best one uh, which is very very reputed that is in Ahmedabad city Gujarat in India and that is called Arochem a r o c h e m if you google Arochem all chemicals they are mentioned their prices are mentioned they are not very costly they are very cheap and just you collect all them and then you can start the manufacturing of your perfume is here So here I have given some uh, explanation, scientific and chemical, about isosuper and lyral. And I have already uh, told you uh, that iso is super is super. So what is its uh, chemical constituents and its uh, structural formula? Uh, it is a synthetic fragrance that was developed in the year 1970s and it is has woody musky scent that has been described as being superior so this superiority of having woody musky is a super 
fragrance. No other chemical is having such type of super uh, fragrance, and that's why in all industries which are involved in manufacturing of perfumes, first thing they will purchase super ISO is super. ISO is super is the mother of all fragrance, and the, it can be prepared with the help of ISO is super, very very expensive and costly uh, perfumes. So that is uh, OD, uh, musky scent, that has been described as being superior as compared to other uh, chemicals, to any other musk based fragrance. And these uh, chemicals, these fragrance chemicals, we call them base because sol we are taking solvent and in that solvent what we are adding, that is called base. For example, if we are taking 70% alcohol or any other benzyl, benzoate or uh, propanol, but in that when we are going to add 20%, uh, 22%, 23%, the like uh, ISO A super, it will be called as this perfume is, uh, that is musky OD base. Musky OD base means this type of chemical compound is uh, used as a base for the fragrances. And ISO is super is used in variety of perfumes and uh, collagens, including our best selling Concord. Concord means when we are with different ratio, we are uh, making the perfume. That is called Concord. And Sale uh, Privy is an international uh, name. If you Google, you will get the detail. And this is the structural formula of this. It is having three benzoic nucleus. One is in broken form. That's why it is called uh, that is naphthalene. So naphthalene type and one, two, three, four. Four methyl is there. So tetramethyl. So iso super is actually tetramethyl acetone style. Uh, then uh, hydro Naphthalene. The second one it is called Lyral. It is the mixture of isomers, and that mixture of isomers it is a mercinol, and in that we are adding uh, that is your propanol. So myrcene is converted into mercinol because myrcene is a type of uh, terpene. This is type of we can see. This is my scene. And once it is converted into, it is called mercinol. And in this mercinol, if we are adding some propanol, it is a thicky, sticky mass. And that's why this liner, once you are going to uh, manufacture uh, sanitizer is called very is called main material of sanitizer. In that sanitizer, take any uh, solvent, alcohol, usually high alcohol, uh, seventy percent less of twenty thirty percent. You can add liner your uh, the material to for the use of as a sanitizer is ready. So it is the mixture of isomers. And that is uh, a peer in of the value. Uh, it is widely used as fragrance, uh, chemical uh, compound in perfume industries, in soap industries, and in skin care products, means which are used for our uh, cosmetic purpose to apply on the skin. And it is uh, prepared by mixing mercinol and uh, propanol. It is viscous liquid. So here it is given some of the important uses of liral and its uh, structure and chemical formula. Uh, number one, 
uh, it is used as fragrance ingredient in the manufacturing of perfume in perfume industry and number two it is used as an excellent chemical stability and color stability in any uh, perfume and number three lidar is a most important sanitizer and it is potent sanitizer fragrance whenever we are preparing any sanitizer lidar is a must without lidar we cannot prepare uh, sanitizer and its combination with uh, solvent with alcohol your uh, sanitizer is ready and lidar uh, structure is given here and c13 h22 o2 so with this i will stop here and i am going to discuss rest of the other uh, that is uh, fragrance chemical compounds uh, they are number 7 or 8 so i have already given uh, about two most important fragrance first one